one, two, three, here we are. Must there be nothing inside here? Okay, we got this thing. All right, got the first letter slash package. Picked up my first fan mail today. That's cool. Let's get in. If you guys couldn't already tell, we are here in the best fishing store in America. Best Pro Shops. Pretty sure this is a brown trout. It looks like a good seven, eight pounds. Mega bass stuff, yes. And we also got the Whopper Floppers. Yeah, I mean, they, they have all the tackle in the world. Like my local Walmarts are all dry of tackle. All right, picked up some braid. You got what, is that for fly fishing? Yep. Ah, fly fishing gear. Looking for some trout nets or basically just some nets we can land fish with. This is a little too big for what we're fishing for. <laughs> Ethan, do you want this one? <laughs> Look at how big this thing is. It's like a good three feet. <laughs> you can wield this thing two-handed. <laughs> well, what is going on, you guys? We are just doing some exploring at a Bass Pro Shops, and I just wanted to take you guys along and just film a video for you guys because we're almost at 2,000 subscribers on YouTube, and I thought it would be fun to just take you to Bass Pro with me and my buddy Ethan. TFO rods. Like, for example, look, that's $169 for this rod right here. It's a eight weight. Huh, not bad. My friend Nathan would like that. Got all the flies here, yeah? Is that a caterpillar or something? Oh, guys, check this out. Pull out these strollers, and there's a bunch of saltwater stuff here. Man, check that out. Have any of you guys ever thrown a fly like this? It's like an eel. Put this on. Give it a try. It'll look good on you. All right, well, Ethan doesn't want to put it on. Back to the shelf. This is why fly fishing can get pretty expensive. This is about the medium price range for a fly rod. They get up to the thousands. I really like this part because they have a fly tying vise here and you can actually tie your own flies. They got a bunch of pictures and okay. Right here, they have a bunch of pictures. Like that's a nice brook trout right there. I love the attention they put to decorating this place. Like there's a bunch of fish mounts everywhere. And at the beginning, there's like a giant tarpon. That's a big tarpon. That's a big salmon right there. Got some stripers here, redfish, bass. Very cool. Like these are all trophy fish. A lot of you guys on my TikTok live streams always ask me, is fly fishing expensive? My response is it doesn't have to be like, for example, there's some combos you can buy. Okay, these are a little bit more expensive. Um, see, look, there's like a $60 fly fishing kit. It comes with your fly rods. Oh yeah, check this out. This is a fly rod that can, can be converted into a spinning rod. My friend actually owns this one. Hot pink color. How's it feel? Not terrible. Mm. <laughs> Love the pink on it though. <laughs> You can like totally go slay some of this trout. Goodbye fly fishing. All right, this is what I wanted this whole time. I want an ice cream ball. What is this? That's so weird. Oh, you put milk and ice in it and then you roll it and then it comes out on ice cream. Wow, cool. It's in the anchor section too. Dude, <laughs> look at this. Have you seen a soft plastic pedal tail this big before? This is like the the length of my forearm. So upstairs, it's more of hunting stuff, but uh, you wanna go check out the bow fishing stuff? Sure. All right, let's go. So quite a few of you guys asked me, why don't I bow fish? Well, this is kind of why. It's quite expensive, first of all. And like, this thing's so heavy. We don't have many fish to actually bow fish up here in Virginia. We don't have that many carp that are invasive and that we can legally kill, so. Oh look, it's a spin cast reel. Imagine if they put a bait caster on here. Hmm, okay, well let's go and try and check out the bottom floor. $47,000 for this thing. Got two seats, 
That's crazy. The feeling of being in the store is awesome. Fishing kit for 15 bucks. All types of soft plastics in here. We got a frog kit. Uh, I mean, those the tails on those guys need trimming. This is probably the most expensive one. It's the KVD square bill box. Those are some nice colors. All right, let's take this thing. Why not? It's a great net, dude. Paw Patrol, yes. I think I'm gonna have to pick this thing up for Ethan. Maybe he'll like it. We are gonna kill some time right now. It's 11.20 right now. The view from the second floor is amazing. Here at the mummy bags, this thing is for negative 20 degrees. Wow, this thing looks so warm. All right, guys, if this video reaches over 150 likes, then I guess I will buy this. All right, let the feeding start. All right, well, that was really cool. Now they're going to feed the trout. All these trout disappeared. Wow, those are true giants right there. Whoa, that was the coolest feeding I've ever seen. Those trout were awesome. Got my... We each just got line, right? Yep. <laughs> All right, y'all, we just finished at Bass Pro Shops Outdoor World. That was beyond amazing, especially the fish feeding. Well, I think that's about it for this video, but thank you so much for watching. We are almost at 2,000 subscribers. So thank you for that, guys. Uh, make sure you leave a like on this video. And as always, fish for the adventure.